All right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to hunter skate as fast as humanly possible. This is the fastest movement in Destiny 2 right now. Um, it's going to require a sword with eager edge, and you're going to have to be on a shatter dive hunter. Okay, now the moment of truth is, can I pull this off first try for this video? So before I begin to explain how to do this, let's see if I can make this happen. All right, simply what you do is you swap to your eager edge sword, you hit the heavy attack button. So right click for mouse and keyboard or whatever input device you're using. And then as you hit right click, you hit jump and then shatter dive almost instantaneously, but it's in that sweet sequence. So swap to the sword while eager edge is procced, heavy attack, jump and then shatter. So here we go. All right, take two here, take three, take four, take five. Yes, we did it. Okay, that was take five. Obviously, I'm going to cut out the fails, but that was take five for me. So I'm not an expert at this. Similar to double slug shotgunning. Didn't quite master it. And this one does take a little bit of finesse. I spent about 10, 15 minutes in here learning how to do this. But I can't explain how to do it because I've done it at least a few dozen times now. So first thing you want to do is, of course, have the proper sword on, shadow dive on. Doesn't matter what exotic you have on. But do this exact cadence. Learn how to do jump shatter dive first. So I put my keybinds on spacebar and E. You can do anything for shatter dive though. Spacebar is jump. You don't need a double jump though, but spacebar is jump and shatter dive. And you need to be able to push spacebar shatter dive like that. And when you can get that down consistently, um, then that's the exact cadence that you're going to use when you right click with the eager edge sword. So be able to pull that off. Obviously, I have to wait for Shadow Dive to cool down. But once you get this down 100%, and that happens every single time you do it, then you'll have it down. If you do this, or if you just do a regular jump and don't Shadow Dive, then you're pushing it too fast. You're pushing it too simultaneously. You need that, like, 0.2 millisecond time delay so that you Shadow Dive like that. So once you get that movement down, then you're ready to go. Then you swap to the sword and pay attention to the timer on the left. It says Eager Edge. Right, and you can also notice that I do have my heavy attack fully charged. If I use my heavy attack or mess it up, I swap off the sword. You see how it takes time to come back to that? So make sure you have your heavy attack fully charged up. You have ammo. I'm purposely doing it here at Morgoth so I can get more ammo from the rally flag. And then if you do mess it up, just make sure you re refresh those. You got eager edge proc and you've got your heavy attack proc. So now I'm going to swap off of it. Give it a few seconds for eager edge to reset. And now here's the moment of truth. How many takes will it take for me to get this the second time? Take two. There we go. We got it on take two that time. So I'm getting a little bit better at it. But once you do get this move down, you can go fast AF in any encounter. It's especially cool in the new dungeon. You can literally go through the sparrow encounter by using that movement. You don't even need a sparrow. You can just fly through on a hunter. So... Hopefully you found this video helpful, useful. Best of, best of luck to you out there skating on your hunters. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed. Smash the like button. I'll see you in the next one. Later.